We're in St. Mark's Square now, and we just ordered some fruit juice. I got peach, and my mom got red orange, and my grandma got pineapple, and my dad got apricot. <laughs> These are what the bottles look like. They taste good. I've never heard of this brand before. I got the Caprice sandwich, and my mom got the breaded chicken sandwich. Mine's tasted better than hers. <laughs> Pretty good so far. I don't think it's worth the 10 euros or whatever it costs though. But then again, we are in a touristy neighborhood. So this is what St. Mark's Plaza looks like, or San Marco Piazza, or Piazza San Marco. We just had lunch, and I'm pretty sure it's gonna be like a million dollars. Here's another beautiful church in Venice. I'd expect to see churches and buildings like this in Rome, but it's still so beautiful. We just stumbled on this little square. Get a little gondolas we'll be going on later. And the line. Well, we pre ordered, so we just have to find where we're going and then go there. Look at that little baby. Ooh. Here's the view from the famous Rialto Bridge. Smooth and rough. So pretty. Ooh, it's hot out here. Now we're just walking around Venice and we got a little hot so we got these nice fruit juices, more fruit juice. I got mango juice which is really fresh and my dad got coconut, which I'm not sure I don't like coconut so I don't know how that tastes. Everywhere you go in Venice, it's really nice. We just came looking for the market, but <laughs> it's closed by now. I guess it's an early morning thing. Sun-dried tomatoes over here. I thought they were fish, actually. And yeah, everyone's closing up now. Too late. Goodness, we are on the gondola. <laughs> I'm so afraid we're gonna tip over. Oh my gosh. It's fine though. <laughs> okay, I'm calm now.
stare lassù e volavo, volavo felice più in alto del sole ed ancora più su This is the square at night We just came back from having some food by the water It was okay, I mean it's one of the cheaper places that we got stuck, we actually got stuck into buying the, that food, but you know what, they were nice. Check out the lights, they're so pretty. They have little sellers just throwing little toys, but I don't see anyone buying, I feel bad. Because it's so old, not everything is lit up. The crowd is still here, but it's quiet, really peaceful, and you could hear live music in the background, actually. There are actually bands playing for restaurants, folks. So if you want to have a nice dinner, I guess come to St. Mark's Square, and then you will have live bands. music for the restaurant goers. So we just got on the Vaporetto and we're coming to this train station but my mom scheduled this to be here way too sooner than normal. So we're just gonna hang out here for a couple hours. There's sun out but it's like a little drizzly. It'll be fine. This is a little bridge by the train station. I like the blue. It probably lights up at night. So this is a bridge from underneath. There's no one here but me. But that's okay. So this is the area near the Ferrovia station. I really do love all the canals. Oh look, is this all garbage? Earlier I saw a place with just construction. Ooh, it's so hot. Trust me, if you're coming in July and August, prepared to be sweating because it is so hot here. I can only imagine how hot Florence is. We're here at the train station and my dad just bought some cannolis but it looks different from the ones at home. It's more like a croissant kind of. It tastes like white cream, like white chocolate cream. It tastes good. It doesn't look anything like the ones from New York though. Maybe these are the authentic ones. Ooh. <laughs>